What we have here today is a uh, changing of a travel trailer tire uh, that you would probably do on the side of the road, uh, preferably in a parking lot if you could. And uh, there's nothing wrong with this tire here. I'm just uh, upgrading the tire to a better quality. The uh, ones that came with this uh, travel trailer are uh, pretty uh, unreliable so I'm not going to take any chances on that so uh, first thing you would want to do is uh, uh, make sure that uh, the trailer is stable if you have it hooked up to your tow vehicle that would be good and I did put the stabilizers down as well not to jack the uh, trailer up just to uh, give it a little more stability and then we'll go ahead and break loose the tightness of the lugs here. Okay, the uh, jack is from my tow vehicle here, and I had placed it on some leveling blocks there, so it'd be uh, tall enough, and I placed it on the frame, and I'm going to use that to uh, jack the tire until it's just barely off of the ground. Now that it's off the ground, we'll go ahead and remove the lug nuts. Now we'll take and remove the tire. bearing protector from the uh, other tire there, put her in there, and then we'll go ahead, place the tire on there, and then start all the lugs by hand. Next I'll just run these down until they're uh, just a little bit snug. Okay, now that we got the uh, lugs run down finger tight, the uh, tire is still in the air here. Uh, we have a three-step procedure, and you're going to need a uh, torque wrench. You're going to set your torque wrench to uh, 20 to 30 foot-pounds, and then we're going to go and uh, tighten up the lugs here. One here, one here, one here, one here, and one here in a star pattern. Okay, our next step is to increase the uh, torque on our torque wrench to 55 to 60 foot-pounds and we're still in the air yet. Okay, now we'll go ahead and uh, run the trailer, uh, lower the jack here and uh, set the trailer uh, back on its tires. Okay, now with the uh, trailer tire back on the ground, we'll set our torque wrench to 120 foot-pounds and then go ahead and uh, torque all of them in a star pattern. Okay, now that that is done, uh, we're going to recheck the torque on here after uh, 10 miles, 25 miles, 50 miles. We'll pull off into a safe area and uh, we'll double check the uh, torque on the lugs there. And uh, after the third time, you should be good. Uh, you're going to also 
want to check your tire pressure before you leave uh, on any trip here and uh, these happen to take uh, 65 psi and it, uh, it's probably a good idea to have a uh, little portable air pump there to uh, go ahead and fill them